Ever wondered who would win in a fight, a baboon or a wild dog? Well today we're going to find out. You see, both these creatures, the baboon, a large primate with powerful jaws, and the wild dog, a fleet-footed predator, share the same territories in sub-Saharan Africa. But who has the upper hand when these two cross paths? Size, strength, speed, and smarts all come into play in this battle of survival. Ready to delve into the world of animal warfare? Let's get started. First, let's meet our contenders. In the red corner we have the baboon. The baboon is a large primate known for its social structures and impressive physical attributes. These animals make their homes in the diverse landscapes of sub-Saharan Africa, where they live in large troops, reflecting their highly social nature. Their physical prowess is truly remarkable. Adult males can weigh up to a staggering 175 pounds, their bodies strong and muscular. They are gifted with powerful jaws and sharp canine teeth, designed perfectly for both foraging and defense. When it comes to their diet, baboons are opportunistic feeders, willing to eat almost anything that comes their way. From fruits and insects to small mammals, nothing is off the table. One of the most striking features of a baboon is its agility. Despite their size, these animals can move with surprising speed and grace, particularly when climbing trees. Their sharp claws not only aid in their arboreal acrobatics but also serve as formidable weapons in a fight. Baboons also possess a high level of intelligence with complex communication systems within their troops. This intelligence can give them an edge in strategic battles making them even more formidable opponents. In a head-to-head -head match the baboon's strength, size, and powerful bite are not to be underestimated. With their sharp claws and strong jaws they are well equipped for a fight. A formidable opponent, the baboon is not one to be taken lightly. In the blue corner we have the wild dog. This canine, also known as the African hunting dog, is an exemplar of speed and endurance, embodying the essence of survival in sub-Saharan Africa. With a lean, muscular build and an average weight of just 45 pounds, the wild dog may appear less imposing than its adversary, the baboon. But don't let its size fool you. The wild dog is a master of the chase. With the ability to reach speeds of 25 miles per hour, it can outpace many of its prey, displaying an endurance that few can match. This dog isn't just about speed though, it's a highly social animal, known for its intricate pack dynamics and coordinated hunting strategies. However, in a one-on-one -on -one battle, this reliance on teamwork may prove to be a disadvantage. In the wild, the African hunting dog's habitat spans across savannas, grasslands and woodlands, areas that provide the open space it needs to utilize its incredible speed. The wild dog's diet primarily consists of medium-sized antelope but it's not averse to feasting on smaller mammals and birds showcasing a flexibility in feeding habits. The wild dog's physical attributes, combined with its speed and endurance, make it a formidable contender in the wild. But in a face-off against the baboon, can these traits secure a victory? A true survivor, the wild dog is a force to be reckoned with. Now that we've met our contenders let's compare them head to head. First, let's talk about their physical attributes. Baboons are large primates, often weighing up to 80 kilograms. That's about four times the weight of an adult wild dog. This size difference gives the baboon a clear advantage in terms of strength. With powerful jaws and canine teeth, they're capable of delivering a devastating bite. Wild dogs on the other hand, while lacking the impressive canines of the baboon have strong jaws and sharp premolars designed to tear through flesh. Next let's look at their behaviors. Baboons live in large social groups and rely on complex communication to navigate their world. They're intelligent creatures, capable of strategizing and making quick decisions. Wild dogs, while also social creatures, rely more on pack tactics during hunts. In a one-on-one -on -one scenario, they might struggle to outwit their opponent. Moving on to their natural habitats, both animals live in sub-Saharan Africa, often with overlapping territories. Here, the baboon's ability to climb trees could provide an escape route in a confrontation with a wild dog. However, the open terrain favors the wild dog's superior speed and agility. Now, let's highlight the strengths of each animal. The baboon's strengths lie in its size, strength, and powerful bite. It's also surprisingly agile for its size, particularly when climbing trees. The wild dog, while not as physically imposing, is faster and has incredible endurance. However, in a one-on-one -on -one fight, endurance might not be as crucial. As for their weaknesses, the baboon is slower and less maneuverable on the ground. It also relies heavily on its troop for support in complex situations. The wild dog, while agile and fast, is more fragile compared to a baboon. 
It's also less effective when hunting alone, as it relies on pack tactics. So who has the advantage in a head-to-head -head fight? Well, it's a close call. The baboon's strength and powerful bite could potentially overpower the wild dog. But if the wild dog can use its speed and agility to avoid the baboon's attacks, it might stand a chance. However, it's important to remember that these animals don't typically engage in fights to the death. They're more likely to avoid each other or engage in brief skirmishes. In the wild, survival is the name of the game and unnecessary fights can lead to injury or death. As you can see, both animals have their strengths and weaknesses. But who would win in a fight? It's a fascinating question, isn't it? And while we can speculate, the truth is that every confrontation in the wild is unique, influenced by countless variables. So, who would win in a one-on-one -on -one fight? The answer might not be as simple as you think. After comparing these incredible animals, it's time to make a verdict. We've delved into the lives of both the baboon and the wild dog, unearthing their strengths, weaknesses, and survival strategies. The baboon, with its formidable size and strength, is a force to reckon with. Its powerful jaws and canine teeth, combined with its ability to use its upper body strength, give it a clear advantage in a solo fight. In addition, its climbing ability provides a potential escape route in a dangerous situation. On the other hand, the wild dog, despite being smaller, is known for its speed and endurance. But without the support of its pack, a solo wild dog might struggle against a baboon. So who would come out on top in a one-on-one -on -one encounter? Given the physical advantages of the baboon, it seems likely that it would overpower the wild dog in a direct confrontation. The wild dog's speed, while impressive, may not be enough to overcome the baboon's strength and powerful bite. However, it's crucial to remember that wild dogs seldom hunt alone, and their pack tactics could drastically change the dynamics of a confrontation with a baboon. In a one-on-one -on -one fight, the baboon's strength, size, and powerful bite would likely overpower the wild dog. However, in the wild, the wild dog's pack tactics could turn the tide. Remember, nature always has a way of balancing things out.